Bread is making a big comeback. Not the industrial made type. This is back to the basics using fresh flour. Well, Shira McDermott and Jana Bishop, they own Flourist, and they are here to show us what they are all about. Welcome to both of you. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm so We're glad you were us. able to come in. I'm just, all this, it just, it smells good. It smells wholesome. For someone who's never been to your shop or ordered anything online, you're at Commercial and 18th. Um, what's, what's Flourist all about? Flourist is Vancouver's only mill and bakery, so we mill fresh flour every day to create all of this baking and then we also sell the freshly milled flour in the store it's fully traceable all canadian made all with canadian. a lot of heart <laughs> all the right notes so what did you bring in today what kinds of things do you sell in in flours today we thought we would uh, show you an assortment of our freshly baked cookies and our sourdough bread we also brought some other items that you can buy um, at the end of your visit um, these would be our super popular um, einkorn uh, hazelnut jam cookies mm. this is a recipe actually that my grandma used to make. We use our whole grain einkorn for this. It's an ancient grain flour that's super popular. A lot of people find they can digest it a little bit well, easier. Well, let's, let's talk about that because mm -hmm. when we say flour, people say, no, gluten-free, I can't, I can't go there. I've got digestive issues and more and more people like bread can't do the bread. Yeah. Um, what's different about this type of flour? What's pretty incredible is we have opted to use a stone mill. That's the mill that you actually see at the very back behind glass yes. in our space. It's the second mill that we own, and the process of stone milling is a super ancient way of crushing grains, basically. Um, we put whole grains into the mill, and what comes out is just crushed whole grains. We don't add anything, and in most cases, like in the case of our whole grain flours, we actually don't remove anything either. So when you're consuming our flour, you're consuming whole grain product that's freshly milled Great. and refrigerated to preserve the precious oils, which is where the flavor and the nutrition lives. So I guess a lot of the, the ir stomach irritability and that type of things comes from flour that's over-processed and things removed from it. And yes. Anyway, we don't have to get into all of that yeah. health things because that, <laughs> let's just concentrate on the yeah. positive. So keep, keep going along the lines of what you brought in. So we added our popular best ever chocolate chip cookies. Mm. This is made with a sifted version of our whole grain flour. It's about 80% whole grain. We use a beautiful custom chocolate from East Van Roasters. Then this is our signature sugar cookie, um, made with our sifted spelt flour, Can't another ancient grain. East Van mm -hmm. chocolate, uh, East Van roasters have been in here as well with their with we their chocolate. But, I mean, let's just talk about people can come into your shop or order your flour mm -hmm. as well online. So you've got bakers that that are interested in doing their own, mm -hmm. uh, or you can come in and just have a coffee and and enjoy something that you want. So what what about people who have no idea sort of where to start with all of this? You've got classes as well. Yes, so we launched sourdough baking classes in the fall and they've been really popular. So we teach people how to make this loaf of bread and this loaf of bread. Um, it's about a three and a half hour class. You get all the instruction you need and all the equipment needed as well to bake at home. Well, I also am interested in the fact when you were saying, and it's made in Canada, so mm -hmm. when you're talking about sourcing the grains, it is Canadian farmers. Why, why was that important to you? Canada grows really, really high quality grains and legumes as well. Most of them are exported. And if we do have access to them, we don't know that they're Canadian. We don't know where they're from or when they were harvested. So mm -hmm. we really decided to break the mold, buy directly from the farmers that grow them, uh, tell the stories of the farmers yeah. that are growing them, mm -hmm. and uh, create a connection between the grower and the people eating the That's food. Feel, so how would you, let, I want to come mm -hmm. on over to this, the sourdough and we've got some uh, garbanzos or ch chickpeas here. What is the secret to a good sourdough? What, and first of all, what's in this sourdough? This is our olive loaf. Oh. People go crazy for this loaf. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> if you're lucky enough to get one. Um, it has two different kinds of olives yeah. and our signature bread flour, which would be the sifted red spring. Yes, yeah. lovely. So who, who comes? How would you describe your customers? We have a really diverse range of customers. Um, we built our space to accommodate anyone. We have lots of spaces for families. We see people coming from all ages, all walks of life. Um, it's not uncommon to see big tables of families of all ages there. And we really wanted to create a community space around the mill, uh, that old community oven kind of vibe, and have a place where people could just enjoy good food. Well, you mentioned the, the stone grinding mm -hmm. and that type of thing. It's got to take a lot of labor. How does that affect prices? Would you say you have to charge a little bit more for, for something that so much, um, I guess, so many hands and, and love go into? 
We have been lucky. It is definitely a premium product, uh, and there's a lot of people that add their expertise to it. Um, but ultimately, we've managed to keep the costs really competitive in this sort of artisan sourdough market. It was really important to us that the bread is accessible um, while still maintaining a really high quality product. It is a beautiful shop. I, I invite you to, to go and check it out for yourself because just the space in being there, just it just feels, it feels very Vancouver and yet you kind of feel like you're in the country all at the same time. <laughs> Shall we break bread? Absolutely. And celebrate Absolutely. flowers? Thank you so much for coming in. Thank, Thank you, Gloria. Mm. That was beautiful.